If you're subscribed to Fun for Louis, you'll most likely know his friend Dave. Now, Dave has recently uploaded a video called My Lovable Cause, and it's basically about his chosen charity that most represents something that he's passionate about. And um, I'll put the link below to that video, um, so go and watch that. But whilst I was watching it, I was inspired to make my own video, so this is my lovable cause. One in around 350 people in the UK suffer with some form of inflammatory bowel disease. Now for you big YouTubers out there that have just had 1 million subscribers, that would equate to around 2,857 of your subscribers suffering with this disease. A disease that's painful and like embarrassing and distressing and sadly it's incurable. Inflammatory bowel disease or IBD is very different to IBS or irritable bowel syndrome. Now while some of the symptoms are quite similar, um, IBS doesn't cause any physical damage to the bowel whereas IBD does. It can cause uh, inflammation, it can cause ulceration of the lining of the bowel and in some really bad cases it can cause perforation of the bowel. The two most common forms of inflammatory bowel disease are Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. Crohn's disease can affect any part of the digestive system from the mouth all the way through to the anus, whereas ulcerative colitis tends to focus on the colon and rectum. Crohn's and colitis are both incurable autoimmune diseases, so the immune system attacks the digestive system. No one seems to know the reasons why. There are some links to sort of genetics and like environmental factors, but nothing's really concrete as to what causes it. A lot of the symptoms, um, known as flare-ups, the flare-ups of the disease, can be managed with or, uh, immunosuppressant medication. Um, but sometimes it could be that the flare-ups are so bad that surgery is required. I know how difficult it is living with something like this because I was actually diagnosed with Crohn's disease in 2009, although the symptoms were starting long before that. I ended up losing half my body weight, I had excruciating pain through like my lower abdomen, I lost a lot of blood, I, my nails went all brittle and my hair started going really thin because I was malnourished. Um, I was tired all the time and like I couldn't even think rationally at that point because I had no energy and I just wasn't able to absorb the nutrients from food because it just wasn't digesting properly because the colon was so damaged. Eventually the bowel became so weakened through like ulceration and stuff like that that after my colonoscopy in 2010 the bowel actually perforated and um, I had to have emergency surgery where two sections of my large intestine were actually removed and I now have two ostomy bags. As you can imagine, I feel quite strongly about trying to support people who went through what I went through, those with either Crohn's or colitis. Which brings me to a charity that's not just funded research, but it's also given like information and provided support for not only the people who have been diagnosed with some form of IBD, but their families and friends and you know colleagues at work and even healthcare professionals just to understand everything much better. My lovable cause is Crohn's and Colitis UK. Please help support the cause and help improve the lives of those suffering with IBD and maybe one day find a cure. All the details are below. I'll put the link to Crohn's and Colitis UK website and my Gibby link. I'll put that below somewhere as well and maybe around here somewhere. Now if you haven't seen Dave's video already, go and watch it now and think about your own lovable cause. Thanks for watching.